What's going on guys? Just giving you guys an update of where I've been at. Um, so recently I've been working on remodeling my garage where I'm going to be pretty much moving my whole company to, right? And so uh, last year I was able to buy a house with an awesome detached garage and I think it's time to move the entire business here. I still have a lease over there and um, I'm waiting for that to, to finish. But in the meantime, I am um, remodeling everything and I'm gonna move everything over here, work from the garage, make shirts from the garage. As of right now, this will be, pretty much this will be the spot, right? Where I'm going to put the t-shirt stuff and then um, I am going to work from here. So it still, I still have a lot to do. I still have a lot going on. And so I just wanted to give you guys pretty much an update and then I'll fully work from home. You know, before I was working, well, I was living in an apartment, so I couldn't make shirts from there. Now, if I really wanted to, obviously, and if I had the space, you can do it from your apartment. But um, what we did was, as our company was growing so much, we got a small office and then we leased out a warehouse and so um, now that we have a house we're going to convert the garage into our pretty much our company headquarters right and um, that's always been my goal my goal is always to work from home my goal has always been to be always be close to my family, to my house. Uh, I take my kids to school. You know, that's just my definition of success, right? I don't want to be so busy that I'm not even home. Like, I don't want to be so busy and working all the time. That's just, that's just not my definition of success. Everybody has their own definition of success. And so, you know, just being grateful that we were able to buy this house last year. Grateful that, you know, we are remodeling everything. And soon, after everything is complete, I'll show you guys a video before and after. But for now, I just want to tell you guys to pretty much keep going, keep moving forward. You know, if you don't have the space to make shirts, try to find any way possible. You can rent a small office. Um, you can do so many different things. You can work from your garage. You can work from your basement. Are we actually... I have to show you our basement setup, right? It's just a table and, and the heat press. But either way, my, my wife makes shirts from there. And so we have something in the basement right now. And then we're gonna, we have everything in the, in the warehouse right now also. And then we're gonna move everything over here. So uh, that's been a life update. We're still making shirts. Uh, we're helping a lot of people start the t-shirt business. And it just brings a lot of um, you know, happiness that we're able to help other people. It brings a lot of joy that we're able to help people at least start their t-shirt business. I think it's very important, especially right now, to learn a new skill on how to make money learn a new skill how to make extra income like you have to do that now i'm telling you you have to do that now stop waiting stop waiting for the perfect time stop waiting until you leave your job stop waiting like if even if you have a a, a regular job right now do it on the side right if you work nine to five after you get off work get to work right get to work on your business think about it if you're spending eight hours working on somebody else's business spend time in your business spend time in your future spend time on something that's yours right and that's why it's very important for us to be well at least for me to be here in this garage because this is ours right and so that's what you want to go after is ownership over there the warehouse is nice it's spacious it's great but it's not ours, it's not mine, I'm leasing it. Like I've been leasing it for almost five years. And so I'm paying, you know, the lease every single month. That money doesn't stay in my pocket. That money goes to them. And so that's what I wanna tell you guys. You have to think about your own business. You have to think about your own future. Like no one's gonna do that for you, right? No one's gonna do that for you. And so if you spend all your life or most of your life working for somebody else, working to make other people wealthy, working to, to help another company grow, that when you're sick or something happens to you, they literally replace you the next day. That's not the way to go, okay? That's just not the way to go. You have to think about yourself. 
you have to think about your future you have to think about your kids future and I'll show you guys I'll show you everything that we do and if you haven't seen my other videos I show you guys step by step on how to create shirts so I encourage you guys to keep going to dream big the goal is ownership own your company own your LLC own your time by the way because right now you know I drop off my kids at school I go pick them up sometimes my wife goes but that to me is the formula for success to do things that I want to do to do things at my time so take back your time take back your life start a t-shirt side hustle right start a t-shirt business now is a perfect time now is the perfect time you know i just want to encourage you guys to keep going dream big i'll show you guys give you guys major updates i'm still working on a lot of different things there's still a big giant mess here but overall i'm happy with the progress uh we have a lot of major major issues we got to do a lot of uh, foundational work we have to do a lot of waterproofing because what happens is water is getting in if you see let me show you guys water's coming in when it rains a lot you see that? So water's coming in, so we have to waterproof, right? And so that's the biggest thing that we're dealing with right now is trying to waterproof this whole garage and make it workable. And then we'll start making shirts from here. So um, I encourage you guys to keep moving, keep doing your thing. And either way, you can make it work. You know, if there's a will, there's a way. And if you put your mind to it, you can get it done. All right, guys. So that was a small uh, update of what's been going on, what I'm trying to do, where my vision is at. And, you know, right now I'm leaving the garage as it showed you. I'm going to the warehouse. And even though the warehouse is still, I would say, what, like five minutes away, right? Um, you know, I'd rather be at home, right? I'd rather be close to the kids, close to my wife. My wife needs anything. I'm there to help, right? And so from, to me, being at home is very important. It's always been the goal. Um, and not only that, it's just, you know, I want to, I want to do what I preach. Like if I'm preaching, hey, you can do this from home, you know, even if you don't have a garage, if you have a basement or if you have an extra room, you're able to do this from your house. You're able to do this from your home, right? And so that's what I want to do so I can show you guys what's possible, right? Everything that I want to do is to show you guys what's possible. You know, when my wife and I started this t-shirt business, first of all, it almost landed in our lap, right? We didn't know what we were doing. We had to learn everything from scratch. But one of the main reasons was to supplement my wife's income and so my wife was was working at the time and she we had our first baby so after the baby was born she went on maternity leave and then she just she didn't want to go back right and i think you know if, if you're a mother you you understand and and when when you have to go back like that when you're ending your maternity leave and you have to go back it's probably one of the hardest things you can do as a mom right because you're so attached to the baby the baby is so attached to you the baby is a couple of months old and just you know returning back to work like you know it's, it's just hard on a mom hard on a parent and um you know she wanted to stay home and to supplement that right because we weren't making that much income um to supplement that was we're like hey look you know the person that we used to get our search from he's leaving and so this might be an opportunity for us to start something and that's how we started okay we started because we wanted to supplement my wife's income and we did right we did like we we pretty much what she was making a month that's how much we were making on t-shirts and so it's possible everything that we preach about everything that we talk about is possible and that's why I want to work from home and show you guys you can do this from home. Not only that, you know, my major goal for these coming years is to really, because we don't really have a t-shirt brand per se. Like we make shirts in bulk and we sell shirts uh, in our online store, but uh, we don't have a brand per se. And so what I want to do is one of our goals is to make a seven figure uh, t-shirt company, right? Not company, t-shirt brand, right? 
that's one of our goals and so that's what we're going to be working on these next couple of months is coming up with our own brand tackling that brand and making it into seven figures and all that i want to show you guys so you can know and you have your belief that everything is possible so i encourage you guys again to keep moving keep going follow your dreams i'm going to the warehouse and i'll talk to you guys soon peace out have a blessed day